Hi, my name is Shongda and today I want to talk about using uh, the latest build of the Magic Lantern. So I'm now using the Kodak Place board on the back of my uh, LCD VF on my 550D. So this is the latest build. So it's the one built on 10th of March 2011. And the latest, newest, or the newest function is called Magic Circles. There's not really any special settings for it, it's just on and off. And here you see it's working. And the use for it is mainly to help you to uh, focus. So it got a actually a zoom so you see a, a square frame in the middle which is a zoomed in version of uh, what you see so now you can actually focus much easier while filming instead of actually looking at a small picture of something sometimes So, it's a quite helpful uh, new function. And you can also combine it with uh, focus picking. So, And also the latest uh, builds have been uh, also quite nice with uh, a lot of new functions like here in the debug menu the save config has been removed because now everything is saved automatically so you can actually um, shut off your camera and actually be sure that everything is still the same so you don't have to like make sure each time that the input is set back to uh, or set to the setting that you had and also there is a lot of nice stuff like the bitrate control the latest bitrate control is much faster and actually you can now film close to like uh, actual 50 uh, mbit to uh, control this so pressing up and down is actually I'm pressing the Q to add it and pressing the playback button to lower it so it's now a much faster button combination and I also want to explain a bit about uh, using white balance so you can actually press either the Kelvin values however it's also quite nice to just press the Q button and it actually automatically searches the best Kelvin value. However, you do need to uh, use a white piece of paper to get the proper Kelvin. And also it's with the ISO. And also the another great thing is the movie restart, which is actually um, uh, yeah, it just restarts or keep filming or actually make a new file and directly just starts filming after uh, you hit one of the limits like the four gig limit or the half hour limit. And yeah, 
uh, yeah, the latest with this I can literally like film like 50 without any problem and you will see on the top right corner the average uh, bit rate so it's now at 40 or oh, actually the should be actually looking at the one on top however when you're filming you can only change it uh, by one jump you can't change it anymore with any bigger jumps as you can see that it doesn't really help anything and uh, you can also Yeah, also there's like a quick button for uh, volume changing you press the flash button and then press up or down you'll see the volume being changed so it's a nice um, yeah nice help for or to able to change the sound volume without having to go into the menu just having a quick button combination also you can change the back LCD the backlight by holding your finger in front of the LCD uh, sensor and then press the button up or down however I do advise when filming to have this actually on too because mostly I've tried all the other settings but the true colors or the true lighting is mostly on too and if you set it higher it actually mostly uh, show you a overexposed picture and actually makes you film a lot of things uh, underexposed unless you're outside you probably want to add the extra light however I find it when you're using LCD VF it's not uh, you shouldn't only if you forget bringing the LCD VF then you should need to have the extra uh, backlight lit up and yeah that was probably most of it you can also have uh, you can also do focus by pressing up or down however I don't have the uh, uh, I have only a manual lens on the camera now and not the a camera with uh, a auto focus so it can help you with focusing and all kinds of stuff so yeah that was mainly it what's inside the new build it's quite a helpful tool with the magic circles so hopefully I have informed you enough information about new builds if you got any questions comment below and have fun filming and see you the next time bye